We're often asked, what exactly does United Way of Cast Clay do? The simplest way to answer that is, we help people. That's it. That's our one single goal, to help as many people in Cass and Clay counties as we can. We help local people from all walks of life. Families, babies, kids, students, teenagers, moms, dads, teachers, elderly people, and maybe even you. And most of all, we help people who need hope, people who want to make their lives better. So think about this. What if some of the things we take for granted, like having food or shelter suddenly disappeared? Well, things like that do happen right here in our community. And United Way of Cast Clay, along with donors like you, help people like Lauren put their lives back together. When I went to Lakes and Prairies, I was in a vulnerable situation, you know, and, and walking in and being able to talk to Dee, and she's like, she could see the tears just welting, and I'm just shaking, my voice is trembling, and for her to just be like, you know, sit down, talk to me, what's going on? I lost it, you know, and just kind of explained to her that, you know, yeah, I'm, I'm homeless, I have a kid, you know, he's a toddler, I, I need to, I, I need to be back on my feet. I didn't want Jamil to be in those conditions. I wanted him to, you know, just, you know, be a kid, and worry about kid things, you know, he was three at the time. And so, you know, I sent him to his grandma's and, you know, that's, that's, he was having fun in grandma's house and I was getting my life together. Now the eviction had happened in September. D created some miracles, and by December 1st, I was signing a lease to another apartment. Half to three-fourths of my eviction, she worked out getting paid for. And I still had, you know, a remaining balance to pay every month. And, you know, I made my payments, and by the spring of that next year, I mean, it was, it was clear it was paid up. I was working at uh, Lady Wellness, which is the all-women's gym, and the operations manager at the time walks up to me. She's like, I need to talk to you pulls me in her office and offers me the director of membership. You know, to go from making a little bit more to minimum wage to being on a full salary with bonus was a pretty, pretty hefty promotion. Life now is awesome. I'm the director of communications uh, for National Hospitality Services. Five years later, to go from homeless to I have an office and I'm saving for a home and, you know, I'm married. It, it's awesome. It's a dream come true. It's my own little fairy tale I got going on. <laughs> there are so many agencies and so many resources that want to help people. Not enable people, not be a crutch to people, but want to help you. Want to help you go from where you're at and help you get to where you need to be. Period. You know? And that's exactly what Lakes and Prairies did. That's exactly what United Way done for me. Is, is help me, take me out of that situation, you know, and get me to where I need to be. And I am, I'm forever grateful for that. How does United Way of Cass Clay help so many people with so many needs? Well, that's where it gets a little more complex. But here's the key. We partner with over 75 local programs within more than 43 local nonprofit agencies that help people right here, every hour of every day. And instead of focusing on just one single thing, United Way focuses on three basic needs, prevention and development, and education. These building blocks help thousands of people and families like yours who live, work, and play right here in Cass and Clay counties. People like Marissa. Marissa is 18 years old, and um, I have had her since she was six months old. Uh, she was born um, a totally normal child with no disabilities whatsoever. And at three months of age, she suffered what they call an anoxic event, which basically, um, for Marissa, it was a SIDS incident, so she's a SIDS survivor. She was at daycare and stopped breathing. She was clinically dead for seven minutes. Marissa was in the hospital for three months, and then she came home with me at six months of age. I met Marissa at a therapeutic riding program about eight, nine years ago. Uh, so it's been, it's been some time. Uh, thank gosh, uh, Marissa was patient with me. Uh, some tears were shed as we tried new things, but you know, what you see on the trampoline, what you see on the swing in regards to where we've gotten to, it's so, so, so important. You know, parents um, with children with special needs, what I was finding when I did a lot of research in our community about what was available, if they didn't staff it, pay for it Saturday or Sunday afternoon, their children just didn't get to participate in a lot of programs. Well, usually um, Marissa comes for her private session every Thursday after school. She's told 
and we have followed through. If you don't do this in school today or you don't do your homework, then you can't go to TNT. So Thursday is always Marissa's star day at school regardless. TNT and the United Way partnership is allowing our public school systems to utilize our facility for physical activity with their special education department. Approximately 20 schools utilize TNT throughout the school year and now with the partnership we'll start probably see more of these schools more on a regular basis and not so limited because of dollars and that's that's really exciting for us. We all have to understand that academics is way deeper than A, B, C, D, E, F, G. The ability to pay attention in class, the willingness to participate in the environment. Um, if, we, if we don't get kids to be enthused and energized and or have the ability to sit up tall in a classroom, it doesn't matter what's coming out at them because it's not sinking in here. The dollars from United Way specifically support the special needs program here at TNT and some of these families do not have the means to come to sign up for classes in the evening. Um, coming here during the day is opening up their world, it's giving them opportunities and physical activity that they've never had before that's helping them with their health, with their self-esteem, inclusion, their social skills and it's a blessing. It's the same thing as you and I. Uh... The su success to me is that she's participating, she's wanting to be here. That's success to me. People see a kid in a wheelchair or, you know, even with a walker, and they would never imagine what Nate can get out of them. It's the movement. They need the movement. They need the freedom. A lot of kids don't know what that freedom is, you know, in their bodies. When you're confined to a chair all day, you know what it's like to be free? It's just amazing. Your one donation not only provides food and shelter to homeless families, but also prepares children for kindergarten. We invest in services that vary widely, but are each extremely important to the people who need them. This level of helping is possible because thousands of people generously give because they know their money helps not just Lauren and Marissa, but all of us. The beauty is that the money raised here stays here. And this is where it gets really cool. Just like all kinds of people support United Way, more than 100 local volunteers review finances, programming, and the impact of local organizations to make the decisions about how the dollars are invested. United Way also helps people like you who want to live united. We help you volunteer through your company, pack backpacks during our school supply drive, or get connected to help a senior during day of caring. Because of the commitment of so many generous volunteers, United Way of Cast Clay is able to be extremely efficient, keeping costs low so that more people can be helped. That's it. That's United Way of Cast Clay in a nutshell. We help people. Without people like you who give to United Way, we could not continue to help people and make our community a better place for all of us to live. We invite you to give, advocate, volunteer.